today's video, we are going to have a practice problem on how to evaluate limits of logarithmic functions. And we are going to explain everything in details. On example number 1, we have limit of log x plus 15 to the base 2 as x approaches to 1. So to simplify, let us substitute the value of x. Let us have log x plus 15, that is 1, plus 15 to the base 2. So let us have log 1 plus 15, that is 16, to the base 2. And since our base is 2, let us write 16 to the base 2. 2 raised to 4 is equal to 16. So let us substitute 16 as 2 raised to 4. This will give us log 2 raised to 4 to the base 2. And since we all know that, if we have log a to the base a raised to n, this will give us n. So, log 2 raised to 4 to the base 2 is written in the form of log a raised to n to the base a, and that is n. So, in our case, it is equals to 4. This will be our answer. On example number 2, limit of log 2x minus 5 to the base 2 as x approaches to 3. So, let us substitute the value of x. Let us have log 2 times x, that is 3 minus 5 to the base 2. So let us have log 2 times 3, that is 6, minus 5 to the base 2. This will give us log 6 minus 5, that is 1, to the base 2. So since we have 1 here, let us write this one as log 1 as 2 raised to 0 because 2 raised to 0 is 1, and then let us have base 2. And since we have log a raised to n to the base a is always equals to n, log 2 raised to 0 base 2 is written in the form of log a raised to n to the base a, which is equals to n. So in our case, it is equals to 0. So this will be our answer. On example number 3, we have limit of log 5x minus 7 to the base 2 as x approaches to 3. So to simplify, let us substitute the value of x. Let us have log 5x minus 7, that is 5 times the value of x, which is 3, minus 7 to the base 2. So let us write log 5 times 3 is 15, minus 7 to the base 2. So let us have log 15 minus 7 is 8 to the base 2. And since our base is 2, let us write 8 to the base 2, and that is 2 raised to 3. 2 raised to 3, that is 8. So this will give us log 8, that is 2 raised to 3, to the base 2, and that is 3. So this will be our answer. On example number 4, we have limit of log 2x minus 7 raised to 4 to the base 3 as x approaches to 5. So to simplify this one, let us have log. And then let us substitute the value of x to the argument. That is 2 times 5 minus 7 raised to 4 to the base 3. So let us have log 2 times 5. That is 10 minus 7 raised to 4 to the base 3. So let us have here log. 10 minus 7, that is 3, raised to 4 to the base 3. So log 3 raised to 4 to the base 3 is written in the form of log a raised to n to the base a, which is n. So in our case, we have here 4. This will be our answer. In example number 5, we have limit of log x squared minus 8x minus 1 to the base 2 as x approaches negative 5. So to simplify this one, let us substitute the value of x. This will give us log x squared, that is negative 5, squared minus 8 times negative 5 minus 1 to the base 2. So let us have log negative 5 squared, that is positive 25, negative 8 times negative 5, that is positive 40, minus 1 to the base 2. Let us have log 
25 plus 40, that is 65, minus 1, that is 64 to the base 2. And since our base is 2, let us write 64 to the base 2, and that is 2 raised to 6, it will give us 64. So let us have here log 64, and that is 2 raised to 6 to the base 2, and that is equals to 6, and this will be our answer. In example number 6, we have limit of log quantity 3x squared plus 2x minus 4 to the base 3 as x approaches to 5. So to simplify this one, let us have log and the value of x is 5, and that is 3 times 5 squared plus 2 times 5 minus 4 to the base 3. So let us have log 3. And then 5 squared, that is 25. And then 2 times 5 is 10 minus 4 to the base 3. So let us write log 3 times 5, that is 75. 10 minus 4, that is 6 to the base 3. This will give us log 75 plus 6 is 81 to the base 3. And since our base is 3, let us write 81 to the base 3 as 3 raised to 4. And 3 raised to 4 is equals to 81. So let us have here log 81, that is 3 raised to 4 to the base 3. And log 3 raised to 4 to the base 3, that is 4. So this will be our answer. For example number 7, we have limit of log quantity x squared plus 9 to the base 5 minus 4 as x approaches negative 4. So to simplify this one, let us have log and let us substitute the value of x which is negative 4 squared plus 9 to the base 5 minus 4. So let us have log negative 4 squared that is positive 16 plus 9 to the base 5 minus 4 and let us have log 16 plus 9 that is 25 to the base 5 minus 4 and since our base here is 5 let us write 25 to the base 5 and that is 5 squared to the base 5 minus 4 so to simplify log 5 squared base 5 that is 2 minus 4 and 2 minus 4 that is negative 2 so this will be our answer on example number 8 we have limit of log quantity 5x plus 2 all over 10x plus 12 plus 6 as x approaches negative 1 over 5 so to simplify this one let us have log let us substitute the value of x that is 5 times negative 1 over 5 plus 2 all over 10 times negative 1 over 5 plus 12 plus 6. So we can cancel 5 and we are going to have log negative 1 plus 2 over we can cancel 10 and 5 because they are divisible by 5. So 5 becomes 1 and 10 becomes 2 and we have 2 times negative 1 is negative 2 plus 12 and then plus 6 and let us have log negative 1 plus 2 is 1 and then negative 2 plus 12 is 10 plus 6 and to simplify this one let us write 1 over 10 as 1 over 10 raised to 1 because we are going to move uh, the denominator 10 raised to 1 into numerator and this will give us log 10 raised to negative 1 plus 6 and since we all know that whenever we don't have base and that is actually 10 so this is log 10 raised to negative 1 to the base 10 plus 6 and since we have the same base the value of log 10 raised to negative 1 to the base 10 is negative 1 then we have plus 6 and our answer is negative 1 plus 6 is 5.
So this will be our answer. In example number 9, we have limit of log quantity 2x minus 20 over 9 to the base 2 third as x approaches to 4. So to simplify, let us simply substitute the value of x. Let us have log 2 times the value of x which is 4 over 3 minus 20 over 9 to the base 2 third. Let us have log 2 multiplied by 4 is 8 over 3 minus 20 over 9 to the base 2 third. And to simplify, let us have log. And since we don't have the same denominator, let us have the LCM of 3 and 9, and that is 9. 9 divided by 3 is 3 times 8, that is 24. 9 divided by 9 is 1 times negative 20 is negative 20. And then let us write the base 2 third. And to simplify, let us have log 24 minus 20. That is 4 over 9 to the base 2 third. In order for us to simplify this one, we must have the same base. So, in order for us to do that, let us write 4 as 2 raised to 2 and 3 raised to 2 to the base 2 third. So, let us have log. Since 2 and 3 has the same exponent, we can write this one as 2 third raised to 2 to the base 2 third. And we all know that whenever we have log a raised to n to the base a, and that is always equals to n. In our case, log 2 third raised to 2 to the base 2 third is written in the form of log a raised to n to the base a, which is n. So in our case, it equals to 2. So this will be our answer. On our last example, Limit of ln 2x plus 5 plus 4 as x approaches negative 1. So to simplify, let us have ln 2 times the value of x which is negative 1 plus 5 plus 4. So ln 2 times negative 1 is negative 2 plus 5 plus 4. So this will give us ln 3 plus 4. So if you are going to press ln3 on your calculator, this will give us 1.0986 and then plus 4. And to write our final answer, this will give us 5.0986. So this will be our answer. So I hope you've learned from this video. Thank you so much for watching and God bless us all.